Hi, this is David Das from Motu. I'm going to show you one of the best new additions to DP8, the Subkick plugin. Here, I'm listening to a multi-track drum recording I just did, and I'm going to put Subkick on the kick drum to fatten it up. What Subkick does is sense the incoming signal and then adds subharmonic frequencies to it and let you adjust them. Let's solo just the kick drum so you can hear what it does. Note that you might not be able to hear the full sonic results of this in earphones or small speakers, but you'll definitely be able to hear the difference in full range speakers. I'll touch on just a few of its parameters. The sensitivity knob here is like a threshold knob that lets you specify how sensitive to the incoming signal subkick should be. The pitch knob lets you specify the center of the subharmonic pitch that subkick is going to add. You can also adjust the level of the added frequencies by using sub trim. And then most importantly, you can mix between the original kick drum and 100% wet, which is only the frequencies that Subkick is adding. And usually you'll want to find a good balance between the two, like that. And that's a quick overview of how Subkick works. It's a very simple plugin, but it's a phenomenal way to deepen the impact of your kick drums.